Hello guys and gals, it's me, Mojo Daddy Mystic, back with my main man, Uncle Ted, and we're going to do Ella Fitzgerald with Mac the Knife. Yes. Now, if you guys don't know, they call her the Empress. Yes. The Empress. Yes. Ella Fitzgerald. Groundbreaking. Yes. Scatter. Yeah. And, uh, superb vocalist. Superb vocalist. And she could hit such a high note, but they used to have this Memorex tape commercial, mm -hmm. and they would record her voice on Memorex, and they would play the tape back, and her voice would crack the glass, man. Oh, man. So, oh, my gosh. She had that high yes, sir. pitch of a voice? Yes, sir. Wow. Yeah, Memorex. Yeah. Memorex tape, man. Incredible. Yeah. So, a legendary performer here. And we're yeah. going to get into the Mac the Knife. Yes, sir. Do you want, is there any, like, background on this song, or? Well, we're going to, I'm not going to break that up. I'm All right, let's, let's watch and yeah, find yeah, out for yeah, ourselves. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, let's do it, man. Yeah. Mac the Knife. Yes. Interesting title. Yeah. Yes, sir. 
So Mac the Knife was a nickname for uh, Mac. Mac the Knife was a character, and you see what his tool of the trade was. What? The knife. Switchblade problem. Switchblade knife. Yeah, stick you quick, yeah. Ooh. And then rob you too. But anyway. So, so knife's called shanking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, man, he's sticky. Right. Because <laughs> he, well, let me say, but that's one of those songs that made, made, made her uh, yeah. a household funny. Everybody say, oh, yeah. you know, Bobby Darren or some guy sang this song, and they asked uh. her to sing it, and she improv it in Europe, man. Just didn't, didn't know, she just made the words, man. She went along, man. Scat. Yes, sir. The Empress of Jazz. Fill in the blank with you know with, 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 with non-syllabic terms that mean something because they they bring it all together. You know they, they, she made them. She made the mess. She, mesh. Yes, because that's her genius. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. So scatting is a definitely an art form that she yeah. popularized. Right. Yes, yeah. she was one of the people that popular popularized that mm -hmm. she and Louis Armstrong. Odetta. Yeah. No, no, not Odetta. Not Odetta. Not okay. Odetta. Okay. I ain't consider okay. Odetta than scat, but. But Ella, Ella was the was the yeah. one. Ella, when I think of scatting, Ella is I, a standard. Yeah, yeah. Ella is in a class owned yeah. by her own. E Ella is a standard. Louis Armstrong, oh, yeah. A guy named John Hendricks, yeah. There and there are a lot of younger people that came along after it. But when you think of scat singing, oh, uh, what uh, Ella is the standard bearer. This is for my mom, Al Jarreau. Al Jarreau. Well, see, Al Jarreau would be one of the grandchildren. Okay. Yeah, he wanted the grandchildren because because learn. Uh, he, yeah. Louis he, Armstrong. He studied. Was, uh, he studied under the Ella yeah. Fitzgerald tree. Oh, oh he studied. Yeah, he studied. Yeah. yeah. Louis Armstrong is the grandfather of Scat, and Ella is the grandmother. Okay. And everybody came after them. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Very well yes, said. Sir. Yes, sir. So we yeah. want to pay, pay yeah. tribute to yes, Ella, yes, yes. Mac the Knife, yes. the Empress of Jazz, yes. Yes. Swanky Swanky Club. I yes. love the yes. piano. I love the drums. Yes. I love the upright bass. Yeah. I'm here for all that. And her voice was driving yes. the musicians. And her voice was like a, was like you said, a human beatbox. She was a human beatbox. She was the metronome. She was the timekeeper. They yeah. had to keep up with her. She could go up. Yeah. And, and they had to, stay, and they had to go along with Ella. They had to pay attention, and they had to keep up. Keep up to yeah. what she keep, was vocalizing. Yes. yes. So. Yes. Very well done. Great recommendation yeah, and Ella Fitzgerald is a, uh, yes. a fine, fine musician. And in, the, in the Jazz Hall of Fame, and, uh, you will find Ella oh, Fitzgerald's yeah. name. And should be in the Rock and Roll Hall of yeah, Fame, right? Yeah, she was, whatever, whatever thing that has to do with vocal, Ella Fitzgerald should be there. Iconic. I'm just going to stand on, she's, I know she's in the downbeat Jazz Hall of, uh, Hall of Fame and the International Jazz Hall of Fame because Ella, Ella did things with her voice that people had never heard before and people have emulated ever since. Well, yes. well she is an icon yes. and yes. Yes. deserves to be yes. uh, remembered yes. and respected. And has one of her records in your collection. collection. At least one. Yes, at least one. So we're going to pay tribute to Miss Ella and what are your thoughts on Mac tonight? Yes. And we'll see you next time. Thank you, sir. Thank you for having me. All right. <laughs>